Hey y'all, I'm Wood Boyles and this is the World History Project. Today's big question is, how do chronology and periodization help historians tell the story of humans? We love to give certain time periods snazzy names like the Classical Age of Greece and Rome, the Roaring Twenties, or the Age of Enlightenment. China's history is divided into sections named after the ruling family of the time or dynasties, but still these had their golden ages like during the Han and Tang dynasties, which is really just historians' way of praising some accomplishment they see as valuable to the story of humans. So are these time periods accurate? Are they named correctly? And do they make sense? One that I believe doesn't make sense is the Dark Ages, a time period between the fall of Rome in 476 and the Italian Renaissance in the 1400s. Historians think of this time period as dark, because there supposedly wasn't a lot of learning happening, and there was a decentralization of power in Europe. However, in the rest of the world, major advances were being made. The Byzantines, or what was left of the Roman Empire, were seeing a cultural resurgence. The Islamic world was making huge strides in politics, science, medicine, and math, and China was inventing all kinds of stuff. So, Historians definitely argue about naming periods, and can even agree sometimes on the dates they started or ended, but we try to find periods that make logical sense to us based on evidence that will help us see what changed over time. We call these big changes thresholds. Our word of the day today is periodization, which is what we're talking about. It means dividing the past into distinct and manageable chunks. To do this, we have to identify a series of events that makes sense when linked together. Today, I want you to read the chronometric revolution. And as you read, think about how historians get to use chronology or a succession of events and periodization in order to tell stories. Then, in your historian's journal, I want you to decide if COVID-19 is a significant marker or threshold in the story of human history. Think about some of the big changes you've learned about before or maybe even big changes you've lived through, and decide if COVID-19 is important in the narrative that historians will tell 50 or 100 years from now. See you next time.